And here is Macy. Just over three minutes left in the second. Danny Ainge with a real big year, Clark, for the Celtics. And you know, Kevin, with him, it isn't so much about the numbers, although he was a double-digit scorer. It's that he pushes the tempo when they need it and dictates the flow of the game. Each key, you're right. Here's Johnson. I love right Defended here. by Macy. Third left side. Parrish with it. Just five to shoot. Pass to McHale. Hits the jump hook. McHale's got ten points. And Clark, another thing about Ainge, he is just a scrappy player. Kevin, he's one of those guys that the opposing team loves to hate. For a guy his size, he's not afraid to mix it up with anybody. He'll get in there and do all the dirty work to come up with a loose ball or a tough rebound. It's part of why his teammates love him so much. And there he goes. He didn't get a three in the first, but starting to look for it here. Bird, the pass to McHale. Woolridge is there. Here's Johnson, and it's Boston with another. That's really a terrific look inside. Set him up beautifully. Here's Ainge. Takes it up. Great finish in traffic. He has six. The Bulls leading by eight. Here's Jordan. Bird knocks it loose. Here are the Celtics with the ball. Eight-point game. Ainge the pass to McHale. And there are the Celtics with another basket. They're doing a much better job of getting the ball in the basket right here. I mean, and they're still trailing, but the momentum they have, if they can maintain that, they've got a chance. Now here's Jordan. Easy shot. Jump shot is good that time. Jordan's got 36. He's got a sky-high field goal percentage, and that's because he's been working to get good look. Here's Bird. Corzine with the rebound. Well, oh, he's had a tough time shooting the ball today. His percentage has been way down compared to what he normally does. I think that's a big reason that they're down. Boy, when you run the fast break correctly, it's a thing of beauty. Here's Johnson. The Bulls getting the bucket. With the Celtics, Clark, they get the ball down the court very quickly. And this is the case for a few reasons. They have excellent outlet passes, both as starters and off the bench. And they also have a lot of guys that can handle the ball. It's part of why they've been so great these past few years in transition. Back and down is Jordan. And they double up Jordan. Woolridge, the pass to Jordan. Fades back. Ainge corrals the miss. Well, he faded away on it for no good reason. He shouldn't have made that shot harder than it had to be. Johnson kicks to McHale. The alley-oop. Nice finish on the alley-oop. McHale's got 14. Those two are in such great sync. I mean, tremendous symmetry there. The perfect pass and a perfect finish. It really looked like he read his mind before lobbing that ball up there. Well, that jam would have been something else. Key words being would have. And that concludes the first half. Jordan having a terrific game. He has 38 points and two steals. More than half their points have come from him alone. Bulls out front, up by eight. Here's Johnson. He's got six, so the Bulls five right now. They're with Mason. Then it's Corzine, then it's Woolridge, and Oakley. Bird can't hit. You gotta expect more out of him here. He's had a lot of difficulty this quarter, which in turn is making it difficult for them to cut into this deficit at all. Puts up the tray, kept alive. Second shot opportunity. Shots good by McHale. McHale's got 16 points. Not bad, partner. If he keeps this up and they can get a few stops, they should be able to narrow this march. Here's Corzine. Scooped up. Macy with it. Outside Jordan. Ainge covering. And they double up Jordan. 
tries to keep it alive. Jordan this year, hobbled by injury, but still Clark, solid numbers. Yeah, well, 23 points a game, Kevin, when you're working your way back from injury, is quite impressive. The shooting percentage is down, but that will climb up as he gets back into the rhythm and flow of things. Here's Johnson. Bird outside. McHale with a screen on Woolridge. Bird kicks to Ainge. Guarded by Jordan. Kept alive. Here's McHale. And two free throws coming up as he misses that one. Drawing the whistle and a lot of contact there. So far in the game for McHale, 16 points and a steal. That kind of mix of assists and rebounds is what wins you basketball games. And to that point about Jordan's numbers, he was limited in minutes as well. Yeah, the 23 points came, Kevin, in only about 25 minutes a game, which is actually better than what he did in his rookie season a year ago. He was still scoring at a very high clip. Powers through the contact to slam it home, and he'll have a chance for a three-point play. What a shot. Took the hit and was still able to maintain control to get it down. Here is Oakley. Now in. Johnson kicks to McHale. Now in. Four on the shot clock. Jordan knocks it away. The Bulls leading by nine. Ainge covering. Ainge against Jordan. And the Bulls tack on two more. We've seen them make three of their first four shots. That's good shooting to jumpstart them here. We've seen them with a lot of good ball movement. That's exactly the way to play. The fans love it. It's fun for the players. I love it. And more importantly, it's tough to defend. And Boston turns it over. That was an ugly possession. They were out of sync completely, and the ball just sailed out of bounds. Making a switch here, the Bulls. And here is Macy. About five and a half minutes left in the third quarter. Bird this year a little down in his points per game, but still Clark a stellar season. Boy, any way you look at it, 26 a game is pretty good, if you ask me. But he also grabbed 10 rebounds a game and handed out seven assists per game as well. That's getting close to averaging a triple-double, which is something that hasn't been done in a long time. Well, Oscar Robertson. That's right. Go back to the big old. Mm -hmm. Here's Parrish following the basket by Michael Jordan. Goes up. Jordan soars with a rim-rattling slam. And Jordan getting close to his game one total of 49 points now. Here's Johnson. Six points for him. Bird, the pass to McHale. And they get it. The shot is off. So the Bulls will take it the other way. And another point about Bird Clark, his percentages are just incredible. Well, Kevin, I say it a lot. The 50-40-90 club. 50 from the floor, 42% from the three-point line, and almost 90% from the foul line. Those are prolific numbers for someone who shoots as much as Bird does. Great play by Bird to set it up. McHale's got 20 points. And here comes Macy. Pass to Jordan. With the shot. And that's collected by Bird. A difficult situation for Boston. Down by 15. Here's Ainge. Hits the quick shot. He's got eight. He's been extremely active out there, and he has the stats to prove it. Terrific hustle. Jordan, Ainge covering, and here is Macy. The tray, that drops, and it comes off an assist from Jordan. The defense made the mistake of playing off him, and he drained it from deep. The Celtics on offense. It's a 16-point game. Johnson, the pass to Parrish. 
gets rid of it. Shoots. Kept alive. Here's McHale. Good D by Jordan. And so here is Chicago. And it's Johnson picking him up. Jordan against Johnson. Stolen away. Kevin, you know, they're still doing a pretty good job of limiting their giveaways right now. And here is Macy. He's guarded by Johnson. Ainge against Jordan. And it's Chicago scoring again. And Jordan has surpassed his game one total now. Just two fantastic games from him.